everyone, Dr. Jeff here with you today. Uh, today I thought we'd talk a little bit about uh, sciatica. I have a number of patients come and see me and they, they, they say, well, my doctor, someone told me I have sciatica. Uh, sciatica is, is, is a nerve. That sciatic nerve is a big nerve. It comes out of your fourth lumbar, fifth lumbar, S1, S2, and 3. It's a pretty big nerve. It's about the size of your thumb. Uh, when it comes out, it goes uh, through your buttock and down your leg uh, to just above the knee in the back and it, uh, it splits into two and goes near your calf. So with sciatica, generally you'll have uh, some numbness and tingling and maybe even some weakness in your leg. Depending on where it's coming from, it can be very specific where it might be a bulge disc or a facet thing pinching one nerve. So it'll be very specific to the outside of your leg or the inside of your leg or weakness in your foot. Other times it could be being pinched somewhere in your buttock possibly. It might be some, some generalized kind of funny feeling in the back of your thigh or even a little bit into your, into your hamstring and stuff. Um, with sciatica, you don't necessarily have to have back pain. Sciatica is not back pain, and back pain is not necessarily sciatica. You can have sciatica without back pain, and you can have back pain without sciatica. So, you know, the two don't necessarily have to go together. My goal as your practitioner, if you come in and you do have some sciatica pain, and uh, you have some pain going down, and numbness going down your leg, it's from where it's coming from. Is it coming from a possible disc bulge? Is it coming from a facet injury, a back strain? Or it could be a piriformis syndrome coming out of a, a, a tight muscle in your butt. Your butt. My job is to try and find out where that problem is and try and solve it. That could be with manipulation, massage, acupuncture, ART, uh, spinal decompression. Whole goal is to determine what is causing that sciatic pain. So if you're having pain down your leg, chances are you're having some sciatica. But just because you have back pain does not mean you have sciatica. If you have any questions about this, you, you can always email me at jgoldsweet at goldswells.com. We can talk on Facebook. Best thing to do, though, if you are suffering from anything like this is is to come in so we can have a look at trying to determine what's causing the issue and come up with a plan to get rid of it. I'm Dr. Jeff, and I've got you back.